Welcome to Driving TV and I hope you are well. Turning right on traffic light, many people get confused on. So it's turning right on traffic light. When it's green and there are oncoming traffic coming from the opposite side, many people they get confused on whether they should be going to the middle and wait for a gap from the opposite side or should they be stopping behind the line and wait until there is a gap. So that's the confusion for many and in this video I like to make this point clear so they know exactly what they should be doing. Uh, so let's get to it. Um, just before I explain uh, the junction turning right, I just want to give you some examples on traffic lights. If you see one of them which is red, it means this red means going left, going straight and going right is red for everyone. This green means is green for everyone meaning left straight or right is green for everyone here this red and you have a filter green red means going straight and left is red but going right you have a filter green meaning you can go right same here this sequence is red meaning straight and left is red and you have a filter meaning going right you're allowed to go this one and this one similar it just the filter is not on the bottom is on this side it's the same meaning red meaning straight and left is red right filter meaning you're allowed to go right normally you will get the filter when the oncoming traffic is stopped on red and for you is green for you to go right so this filter is stopping the oncoming traffic on red so you can go right sometime you will get two sets of traffic light uh, next to each other and uh, this is where many people get confused on the confusion is this one is for going straight and left only and this one is to go right only so when this one is green the straight and going left is allowed to go but not right for right you have to wait until your one is green then you're allowed to go not when this one is green so going right, this one is green, and going straight and left when this one is green. If you are learning and you need help on learning and passing the driving test, don't forget to take the advantage of our online course. The course gives everything a learner needs to learn to drive and to pass the driving test. It has everything a learner needs. I will leave a link on the description for you to have a look. Have a look and see and read, and if you like it, you could always join the course. Imagine this is a junction controlled by traffic light. You are coming this way and you want to go right. The traffic light is red, so you stop behind the line and wait for it to be green. When the traffic light is green, you proceed and if there is oncoming traffic coming, which means they have priority, you go halfway and stop in the middle, wait for them, looking for a gap. If you find a gap, you carry on going if you don't find a gap, this traffic light could have a filter green, so you wait for a filter green, or you wait for the traffic light to become red, which means they will stop, then you carry on going. Now many people get confused on, when the traffic light is red and they are halfway, they get confused whether they should go or they should just stay here. Remember, the red light is only for people who's behind the line. If you've crossed the line, and waiting for a gap this traffic light is not for you anymore you are just waiting for a gap or waiting for them to stop which means you couldn't find a gap they will stop when the traffic light is red when it is red you don't stay in the middle because you are blocking the junction you will have to go so just to make it clear when it's green you go halfway and then you wait for a gap you either find a gap or you might get a filter green to go which means they will stop or you wait for the traffic light to become red which means they will stop and you carry on going on another junction you might be the third or the fourth on the queue and there could be few cars in front of you which means on is green there might be two car taking that space which means you don't have a space to go so what do you do you stop behind the line until they go now while they are waiting when they do find a space when they go 
by then maybe the traffic light is gone red now which means because you are behind the line you have to stay behind the line until the traffic light becomes green again but on another scenario there could be a car and you are behind them because the space is already there for you to go on the other side so you are waiting behind a car and while you are waiting behind that car now the traffic light is gone red the car in front goes what do you do then because you've crossed the line you have to go if you were behind the line you stay but because you've crossed the line you have to go you don't stop behind the uh, sorry you don't stop on the middle of the junction on another junction there might be a car already waiting in the middle here who wants to go right now because you want to go right too the question you need to ask is do you have the space to, to go behind that car if the answer is yes then go and stop behind that and wait for a gap and then wait for this one to go first when this one goes then regardless the traffic light is green or red you will still have to go because you have crossed the line if the space is not there stay behind the line what you cannot do is stop like that which means bit of your car or little bit of your car is still on the line and most or half of your car is on the other side which means while you're waiting for this one if this one goes and then the traffic light becomes red and you carry on going you will be counted as going through red light because your car was still on the stop line so you must make sure that your car goes fully on the other side of the stop line if the space is not there or you're not sure then stop behind the line and wait until this one goes when this one goes and then if the traffic light is green then you carry on if not you stay behind the line on another junction you might get two sets of traffic light next to each other one on the left one on the right the one on the left is for people going straight and left the one on the right is for you to go right so don't get confused on the left one only goes green don't go yet because that's not for you for you is the one on the right when it's green that's when you go on this traffic light coming up we will be turning right and uh, as you can see the traffic light is red which means that uh, we have to stop behind the line until it is green for us to go there is no vehicle front of us which means when it is green we will proceed halfway and stop in the middle and give way to any oncoming vehicle or until uh, the traffic light changes to a filter green filter or if the traffic light changes to red and as I have already explained to you before that uh, traffic light red meaning stop if you are behind the line and if you've crossed the line you don't stop anymore you carry on when it is red so we we'll just have to wait until the traffic light changes now it's changing so we go halfway and stop in the middle and wait for those vehicles coming from uh, the opposite and now we have a gap after this car so we just carry on making sure it's safe the road that we are going in and we proceed on this traffic light coming up we will be turning right again and uh, as you can see it's red which means we will stop behind the line until it is green for us to go now here as you can see if you look straight ahead on the right hand side there are two sets of traffic lights next to each other and both of them are red now the one on the right out of the two is for you the one on the left out of the two is not for you it is for people who's going straight many people they get confused on when they see the one on the left is green and they want to go right and they start to proceed this is wrong you have to wait until your one which is the right out of the two is green now as you can see the one on the left is green it's a filter green and the people going straight are now going as you can see because they are on green for you still red and you have to wait until your one which is the right side out of the two is green 
then you start to proceed. But for now, you have to wait because it is red. Now the one on the right is changing, which means we can go. And so we start to proceed. As we go, we see the one on the right, which is our one, has a filter green, which means if there are any oncoming traffic, we don't have to worry about them as much because they won't be coming, they will be on red. So we just see if it's safe and we carry on going. And here on this traffic light, as you can see, is green for us to go right. And you see we have a filter, which means even though there are oncoming traffic, they're not coming because they are on red. On this traffic light coming up, we will be turning right. And as you can see, the traffic light is green, which means we can go. But here the problem is the van is already in the middle waiting for it to go right, which means we don't have a space behind the van, so we can't go. We have to stop behind the line until there is a space. By the time the van went, the traffic light became red, which means we must stay behind the line until it is green again. It's now green, so we go to the middle and we wait for the oncoming traffic. Now we have a gap and we carry on going. On this traffic light, we will go right. As you can see, the traffic light is now green, so we will proceed to go. There are a few cars in front, which means they must go first, then we will go. There is a car already waiting in the middle, which means if there is a space, we will go behind that car and stop. There is a space, so we will go and behind that car and stop. Now that we have already crossed the stop line, which means regardless, we won't be stopping in the middle, we will be going, even if the traffic light becomes red. So we will wait until the car in front goes and then we will go. The car in front now goes and we will proceed. There is oncoming traffic, but because the traffic light is red, they will stop and we carry on going, even though it's red because we were already in the middle past the stop line. That's it for today and I hope you've uh, enjoyed the video. If you did, please do give a thumbs up and if you are new to the channel, uh, don't forget to subscribe and uh, hope to see you again on the next video. Thank you for watching.